Justin, do you do, do you want to talk about your theory? Yeah, I do. I do. As a matter Mayan of fact, calendar. I let me just theory. say this, uh, people, listeners. Um, <laughs> I can't believe that nobody has come up with this yet on their own and that I have to be the, the, the mouthpiece of this because this is exciting. Yeah, this is this is some heavy shit. That I don't I've, even know what this is. Well, this is basically this explains Jesus Christ. This Whew. explains Muhammad. Oh my god. This explains the Mayan calendar. This <laughs> explains everything. The meaning of life? Yeah, and our purpose me, in the universe. Let me let me let me just start by saying that, you know, you did cast the right guy. There, there's yeah. a lot. There's a lot of. There's a lot of stuff going on behind the scenes that you know, and I think that we're all moving ahead to this culmination of, you know, this big shift in dawning of the time. age of okay. Aquarius. Yes, Jesus, man. thank you. The buildup okay. is. Here's yeah, what I did. Killing me. I've been reading, Chariots of the Gods. Okay, it's a ancient alien theory book. It's classic. It's 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 filled Don't just with facts. Toss that off. Uh, an ancient alien book. What, well, what is it's, it? It's it's based. You've heard of the show Ancient Aliens, right? On History Channel. Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay. Well, I read Ancient Alien book by Jack the, the Cash. entire theory. Is huh. this is this is what I believe to be true, <laughs> and 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 take it or leave it, ladies and gentlemen. But I think that you know Christians and all these religions, it's time to wake up and and realize the truth of the situation. Jesus Christ was an alien. He was an alien traveler. He visited this. Hold on. He visited this planet and he bestowed information to a bunch of fucking villagers with mites all over them. And they were wearing paper bags and shit. And they didn't even have the ability to write things down. They were bumping into each other. A bunch of idiots. Uh And Jesus Christ comes down in his spaceship in the woods. May I remind you, there was a relative level of civilization. Well, whatever. I mean, you know, look, it wasn't wasn't very civilized. I mean, I just want to to make the historical context clear. (laughs) Whatever. It It wasn't Neanderthal. Souls. As far as I'm concerned, it was a bunch of idiots and rags running around bumping into West, each other with West for fire lice and mites. And sh- yeah, it was horrible. Okay. And Jesus Christ comes down in his spaceship. Uh-huh. And here's the deal. Jesus Christ, he so this is what happened. You go back to Mayan times, right? The fucking aliens were here. They they visited and they said, here, we're going to help you build these temples, and we're going to help the, the, the Egyptian people build these temples, and we're going to, this is going to be our, our sign to future, the future civilizations that we were here, because they're going to be like, oh, no way, those, those fucking idiots did that by themselves. They had to had help. And then here's the deal. We got to go. We got, we got shit to deal with across the solar system, but we'll come back. And when we get back here, um, it's going to be 2,000, blah, 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 5,000 years, whatever it was. So here's a calendar, Mayans and Incas and all these other Aztecs and motherfuckers. Here's a calendar. That it ends on this date because uh-huh. that's when we're going to be back to uh-huh. check up on you guys and uh-huh. see how fucking everything's been doing, yeah. right? So Jesus Christ, he was just one of the guys that happened to be like a satellite. He came back early. He came back early to check up on everybody. So Jesus Christ comes down and he's like, Hey, what's going on, everybody? He's, he's there to regulate. Yeah, he's there to fucking check in, and and and, and he he's probably appalled at what he sees. Like, holy shit, they don't even know about the Mayan temple. They don't even. These people are fucking idiots. They're bumping into each other. They have lice. They don't know what the fuck. They're wearing they paper, they're wearing paper, paper bags. Lice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're idiots. Uh-huh. So Jesus has got all this information that's really important, and he delivers it to the people, and then he gets killed, and it's horrible and whatever. But what happens is. <laughs> No, what happens is all that information that is that is bestowed, and he does do miracles. He he heals the blind. He's using technology. Yeah. He's using alien technology, alien super advanced alien technology to heal the blind and to ET turn a shit. walk on water. Wa- water into wine and all this shit. It's, uh-huh. He just has an advanced iPod, uh, uh-huh. an advanced iPhone, basically. Tricorder. Yeah, tricorder. Uh-huh. And he you know he kind of hides it in a loaf of bread or whatever the fuck. <laughs> what you know, do he they does, know? Yeah, they don't know yeah. shit. Or maybe he had it out out straight up in their faces. Well, he hides don't it know. in a loaf of bread. <laughs> the po- and the reason. <laughs> A loaf of bread was an iPad. That, that, that gives way to lots of hijinks. He, 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 uh, Jesus, can I make you a sandwich? Sure. Oh, go! Wait a minute! Not that? that bread! <laughs> he probably had it right out in the open. He was probably lasering people's eyes and fixing the blind and healing the crippled and straight up doing it with regular scientific, you know, future technology. Uh-huh. But then what happened is he gets killed because they're like, oh, he's a fucking witch. Kill him or whatever their problem was. Uh-huh. And then all his apostles, the people, he, he, all the humans that he had said, okay, you guys are disciples? my inner circle disciples. I'm going to give you the lowdown. Mary Magdalene, all you motherfuckers, you know, Judas, everybody, the whole, all of you. <laughs> you're all going to get the fucking, you're going to get my real, <laughs> my real 
you know, Low lot down. of info. <laughs> I'm an alien, motherfuckers. I'm a goddamn... He tells them the whole thing, Was right? it like the scene in Beetlejuice where it was just behind his head and then... <laughs> And then yeah, yeah. Oh! It, it's I metaphorically mean, like did he, did that. Did he appear to them as a as a is it with a no, beard? Just, listen, or when these he... when these al- when these aliens come back in at the end of this year, uh-huh. the the it's marked calendar date uh-huh. when, when the spaceships arrive and uh-huh. uncloak, uh-huh. they're then they land. They're just gonna look like us, slightly yeah. taller, maybe really? skinnier. Why? Yeah. Because we're all from the same DNA. They seeded this fucking planet, dude. Uh-huh. But ah, anyway, hold on, hold on. That hold on. was in Prometheus. Yeah, I know, exactly. Justin, maybe you here. should start watching movies. And hold on, hold on. I hey, say, can I say something <laughs> yeah, yeah, real yeah. quick about yes. Prometheus? I'm okay, sorry, yeah, yeah, no, go ahead, go ahead. No, it's a, well, what's now so fascinating about Prometheus? And by the way, I haven't seen it, so don't spoil it <laughs> Exactly, that's what I'm, that's what I'm going to talk about. Okay, don't like, spoil it, though. No, exactly. I've been so fascinated by everyone talking about Prometheus that, ha- that have not seen it. And everyone talks like they have seen it. Ryan, like, have you seen it? Oh my god, yeah. I've no, seen but it. what's yeah. funny is like everyone's like, "Oh yeah," it is, and it's like this and that. Oh yeah, but they haven't seen it. So what? What? what are, what's wrong with these people? What's the matter? I don't with these know. People? It's Liars. just like well, it's probably first not of that all, hard to reference the movie it's and not have seen it. It's fascinating. So I haven't seen it. You have. I, I feel study, like I've but seen you it. know the storyline. Well, you don't know. start telling me that it's my theory it is on your religion. Theory. I'm sorry. It is I didn't. I didn't mean to. Well, hold on, hold on. If you want to say that they seeded the earth, fine. But I, I, my shit goes way deeper than that. I mean, I've got Jesus Christ pegged. Yeah. I've got all these motherfuckers pegged. That's what they and and they did that in Prometheus. Well, not not explicitly, but people's theories are okay. Thank People's you very much. The theories are that there is the that, that that what happened is is that that one of their oh, kind spo- came, excuse alert, me kids. one of their kind it came out six months ago one of their kind <sighs> came down six was crucified ago. and then 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 the, then the aliens who seeded planet Earth and created us out of the same genetic material was like well fuck that we're gonna create some big old boogin aliens and have them come down and tear okay, shit well, up okay well listen okay that's not Bring what I'm saying reckoning. okay stop it chestbuster well. style ladies and gentlemen I'm not reciting the plot to Prometheus I'm telling you right now <laughs> Jesus Christ was a, was an alien who was sent by the race that, that the, of aliens that was back in the Sumerian times and the Mayan times and like the mm. ancient times paper bag people times who came to this planet actually uh-huh. as a fucking checkpoint onto a bigger mission uh-huh. they stopped off because they, they their detectors said oh the, the, we could pull off here and load up on materials this planet's very ripe and what did they this, load up on? they probably got oil and whatever the fuck they needed I don't know how uh, did they change iron anything? And down minerals. and uh, had sex. Yeah, they <laughs> fucked the villagers. They impre- they did actually impregnate uh-huh. lay people uh-huh. with their seed, uh-huh. and 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 that's how they seeded the planet. There were already gorillas and and cave people. So we're all and they half gorilla, them. half Sloths. alien. They did it as a favor to us, uh-huh. and now we've got iPods because of it, and we've got uh-huh. fucking this. That, well, that wasn't very responsible. Now hold so on. Now they're mad because we didn't listen. It all know ties to together. Do? It makes perfect sense, and I implore uh-huh. the listeners of this podcast to just. Sit back and 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 think about what I'm telling you because you know in your hearts it's true. Everything you've ever learned, it I can tie it all together with this. The the Jesus Christ was he was he was the satellite alien. He was sent ahead of the of the pack to check on Earth, and he Wait, came can here. Can I ask you a question? He, hold on. And Jesus Christ said, "Here's my here's the info, right?" And they they all wrote their little books with their with their dirt <laughs> pens and their papyrus <laughs> bullshit paper, and then. All the time, it's like a game of telephone. All the time passed, and then all these people in power, Constantine and all these people, they took all that shit. The fact that he's an alien, and they're like, they burned it all. They're like, that's crazy shit. Burn it. He, all, and then they reinterpreted what Jesus said, and now here we are with Christianity, and we're mm. fucking banishing the gays, and we're all this yeah. shit is going on. No, okay. no, hold on. Now, now, How hold on. How much longer? Now, now the spaceship well, that crashed I mean, Jackie, in 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 in, a, in, in a, Nevada a paradigm Wait. shifting the spaceship theory. that 51? crashed in Nevada, the, uh, Area, Area 51, 51, the fucking um, New the, uh, no, 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 uh, what is it? No. The crazy uh, something new? No, the the little alien. What, where is that at? BT? Roswell. Roswell. Thank Roswell. you. Roswell. Roswell. The Roswell, Roswell. incident uh-huh. was another Tom one Boswell. of these fucking <laughs> alien people uh-huh. checking in on us. Uh-huh. Guess what? Brakes went out. Boom. The same paper crashed. bag people times. We go have fucking mice they on us. They were checking we're in gonna, on us. Yeah. And yeah. guess what happened? It's and, a different story. And they this were time. just barely ahead of the of the main fleet. A little bit. Mm-hmm. And they were coming in, they crashed. And guess what mm-hmm. happened? We harvested the crash and we took all the technology and now we have iPhones, Jackie. What do you think of that? <laughs> what do you think of that, Jackie? I mean, 
we can't even have an A B C conversation and it's just you ranting. So okay, what's I'm the ready next to topic? I'm ready to field questions. What's the next okay. topic? Well, I'm ready to field questions. Wait, he's now. ready. He's ready. <laughs> I'm ready. Okay. I feel like I've sufficiently communicated my theory, uh-huh. and I'm ready to field you feel your questions. Pretty sound, pretty airtight. Feels great. I'm, it feels good to finally get that off my chest and put it out in the world. Yeah, now I'm ready to know. take questions. Uh, Maybe you guys have deeper concerns oh, yeah. but I, I don't know if this is an offshoot of that yeah theory but like the moon is actually a uh, spaceship have you heard that yes theory? it is it, is that part of well I, I i maybe that, i don't know it's tough to say i know that mars had something to do with something at some point but no actually the moon was an actual space straight up sphere like like, like the like the death be, star like yes exactly like and over time it's, yes it's over time it's look, what for, look it up <laughs> for all we know that could so be true but anyway what are we we're insects walking around like a bunch of idiots bumping have, into have, each have, other have, fucking wearing paper bags but also i also like the uh, jesus like maybe there's a parallel to et jesus maybe. was like et yeah. i swear you guys have to fucking believe yeah. me listeners of this podcast please <laughs> but I'll let go you guys... to your church officials Wh- and are... try what? to t- make them understand <laughs> right i'll let you guys weigh in on this go ahead yeah. what do you what do you want to know well a couple things go there's ahead. the part of me that just of course wants to just have fun with you and your crazy yeah go brain ahead. and there's part of me that wants to just be the rational person well, that wh- i am wh- what's what's the better more entertaining uh, i have no yeah. idea <laughs> but uh <laughs> The first, the first thing I want to say is that Justin, by the way, in case anyone thinks or has ever thought, oh, this Justin Rowling, he needs to come up with these crazy theories for, for the sake of entertainment. No, no, no. When I arrived here tonight, he said, I've got this theory, uh-huh. and I've been really thinking a lot about <laughs> I it. I have. In earnest. Mm. This yeah, isn't yeah, a yeah. joke. Yeah, I've been spending a lot this, of time. I am looking at his genuine. mouth. His tongue is not planted in his cheek when he no, says no. these things. I'm, I, I really feel like this Passionate. is true. <laughs> and listen, if w- when we cross the threshold Jesus. of the of the t- 2012, December 21st, blah, uh-huh. blah, 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 blah. And it does, and they're not, and they don't arrive. Mm-hmm. Then I'll have to kind of take. A couple that crow. always happens, though. <laughs> every to, time, yeah, I'll have Justin, to take a every few... time that every time, like whenever yeah. anyone says like this is the date, and it's not the end of the it world. It's happens. not the end of the world. No, it's, it's just the, the return beginning. of yeah. our keepers. It's the yeah. return of the well. They're, well, they're, they're worried like about Ghostbusters. And this is why huh? you can take That's solace in this. This is why you can let it. You can focus on this and let it relax you, is because no matter <laughs> what kind of political stri- strife, 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 strata, strata, and, and, strata. And, 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 and and sort of economical and and uh, and sort of ec- uh, this, uh, this theory is for everybody, folks. No, no, but like these aliens are going to come back and they're going to fix it all for us. They're uh-huh. going to go, whoa, holy shit, you guys are polluting this place. You're yeah. fucking bunch of assholes. Hold t- everyone, you relax. Us. <laughs> Yeah, you picked uh, Justin Roiland over Ryan Ridley for this part. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of fucked up planet is this? That's You're out. It. You killed Jesus? Or just he was just a fucking grunt worker, uh-huh. and you killed him? Uh-huh. He healed blind people. Wait, Jesus was a grunt worker? Yeah, he was like just so, a... so. So these guys are gonna be like, oh yeah, ten times. Oh man, I mean, we we goofed on Jesus. That's why it, we sent him down here. And Je- you... Jesus was just a fucking peanut. Uh-huh. He was he was just a guy that they said, uh, uh-huh. uh, Jesus, go go. Um, we're busy with yeah. more important shit. Will you go back and just check on that place and make sure that they haven't fucking destroyed it yet? Oh yeah, sure, cool, bro. I'll go check it out. Yeah. Put me in a pod, shoot, cryogenically freeze me down in the fucking pod, and shoot me back there. And Jesus lands in the woods. He Wait. unfreezes, and then he fucking goes to where the city is. Knocks on, knocks on the door of Mary Nazareth. and Joseph. Hey, yeah. uh, can I? Can we come up with a story together? Like where maybe you gave virgin birth to me? Yeah, or something? exactly. All know. that shit is bullshit. He wasn't born. Uh. It's a fucking bullshit. That was all written by Constantine and tell a big fat game right. of fucking okay. telephone over Fair the course enough, of X Justin, amount of Justin, here comes the. Yeah. Rational side. All right, let's Where's hear it. Jesus's pod? Jesus's pod? Are you joking? It's fucking gone. It's disintegrated. It's at the bottom of the deepest part of the ocean, or it's buried under miles of sedimentary rock layers. <laughs> what, the, what are the, you the, kidding the, me? The, the, what, what are you talking? When did he land? He Earth. landed when mountains he... mountains weren't for set layers of sediment weren't do, forming. Do you realize years that the ago. story of Jesus is he was born and oh, gee, uh, uh, a virgin Ranger. birth. Wise men, the three wise men. The three wise men came uh, and all this shit, and then nothing for 30 years. And then, oh, now he's fucking healing people. And that's because it's two different. That's not true. There's, motherfuckers there's documents happen. of his okay. teenage life. Look, bullshit. What, what, what did he do? Was he fucking girls and like fucking <sighs> smoking cigarettes Listen, and shit? Aside, on, from, aside from the fact that your theory is just Perfect. several different, disparate, bizarro, whacked up conspiracy I, theories how cobbled dare together. You? How dare you? What are we supposed to do, and our listeners are supposed to do? Our, our listeners are. Year olds, this what is are they what supposed I'm telling to do? To do do any, go to their church ladies leaders, and gentlemen say? let me tell our listeners everyone who's listening to this podcast right now i want you to do what i did when i discovered this and put all the pieces together talked about it on a podcast no no no. take a deep breath 
in and out. Relax. Let it sink in. Let it sink in and realize, hey, we're we're gonna we're gonna be okay. We're gonna be okay. Yeah. We're gonna be okay. Wow. Let, shake off that sadness <laughs> that that our our society is just yeah. slowly heading towards demise, nuclear warfare, or whatever Street the fuck warfare, it is. Economic collapse. Yeah. Epi- economic. All those pandemics. horrible. All those horrible apocalyptic thoughts. The the fucking doomsday prepper mentality. Just fucking relax. The aliens are going to take care of it. How the many, aliens uh, are coming. They're going to fucking fix it all for us. Uh-huh. We're fine. We're totally fine. And if they don't come when they said they were, it's because something they're happened. They're running a little late. Yeah, they're running late. <laughs> something happened, and they'll be here eventually. Yeah. I know Justin, you know. I want to believe this yeah, so he bad, wants dude. To believe, he wants to believe in something, but he, <laughs> he, he in his heart he knows that we're doomed. You know, I also so he read, buys gold, and also, he stocks up on doomsday prepping supplies. I also read ch- 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 Children? Ch- ch- childhood End. Uh-huh. Ch- oh, ch- that's such that? a good book. What is that? It is so good, right? What is that? Yeah. Well, that informed this theory as well. And the, uh, just read it, kids. I don't want to sit here and fucking recap the story of Who childhood. Who wrote that? In. Wasn't he friends with L. Ron Hubbard? Mm, Ray, uh, no, Ray, but there's Ray a great Bradbury, story. No, no. L. Ron Hubbard and Rod Serling. There's a great story where no, the Those guy that Arthur C. Clarke, I think, wrote Smoke it. Weed together. Okay, right. there was a writers, uh, sci-fi writers like conglomerate w- way back in the day where all the sci-fi writers, writers, writers would get together. And they would all read and pitch each other like, this is a book I'm working on. And then L. Ron Hubbard, Arthur C. Clarke, Ray Bradbury, wow. all these fucking guys. And, and L. Ron Hubbard Just came one day. together. L. Ron Hubbard mm-hmm. came one day, and he was working on a story, a book, a sci-fi book. And he said, listen, I've got this book, and uh, the character finds himself on another planet, and he's stranded. What would he do to try to get money? Like, like I'm, I'm at a crossroads here. I can't figure it out. To, and to get to the next point in the story, I need to know. So help me workshop this. And I think it was Arthur C. Clarke or Ray Bradbury, one of those legendary guys, said to him, uh, well, your character should just create his own religion and then on this planet. And uh, and then he can use that money to go back home. Mm-hmm. And then Ray Bradbury – or I'm sorry, um, uh, uh, what's his name? Ron Hubbard. Ron Hubbard. Jesus Christ. Uh, said, uh, ah. And then fucking – See, I've heard a different and then version. Left I've and heard never a... came back to another one of those meetings. Uh, never came back. Oh, uh, what did I, you hear? What did I you heard hear? that it was more of like a who can think of the most ridiculous scheme or scam. Oh, wow, yours has been tainted by lies. <laughs> no. Mine is pure reality. Yours has been tainted by the evil science, like the it's anti-scientologist. Cynical. Wait, how cult. is yours any, how is yours pro-scientology? <laughs> well, I just feel like mine's more true to the reality uh-huh. of what happened. Uh-huh. It's just like my theory on Jesus Christ and all uh-huh. this other stuff. And Christians and all these people that are like anti-abortion and they're all fucking worked up about gay people and all that stuff. Hold your rope, bro. Go back to the source material. The the lost so the gospels. Aliens, the aliens are cool with abortion? Yeah, they don't give a fuck uh-huh. about abortion. Uh-huh. All they're worried about is the propagation of the society, of, of this What do of they this want mankind. from us? They want us to stop raping this earth. We're killing it. We're like a virus. Uh-huh. They're going to come back then and say, whoa, all the shit us? we taught you motherfuckers. What did they teach us? They didn't out. teach us anything. They taught, they, they, they taught us a lot and then we lost it through the course of time. Why didn't they come earlier? Listen, what is the you know how many hard drives I have? They tried. That, that, that the information's lost and I can't get it back? That's what the, the, these okay. fucking aliens I got are it. dealing well, with. Can we hear about the fake uncle? Uh, <laughs> Uh, the, 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 the fake right. uncles come. The aliens should have chosen no, a prophet no. with with a with a larger audience. Well, no, the maybe, aliens, maybe the, the nerdist, aliens, the aliens, they they had no idea that we were Adam so Carolla. animalistic that we were gonna kill our this fucking guy, and he kind of showed up, and he was a little bit like, you okay. know, well, anyway. you know, he lost his fucking tools. Rent his Prometheus, rent Prometheus. No, and don't do that. Is it out yet? Just yeah, re-listen probably. to what I oh, re-listen to this segment over and over until. <laughs> And send us an email and don't, if and you by have the any way, questions about it. By the way, uh, p- people in a thousand years, I hope you're not changing everything Justin says yeah, and slowly you. warping no. it, mutating it, and bastardizing it like no. Constantine and the yeah, Catholic Church exactly. did to alien Jesus' yeah, original you. words. People of the future a yeah. thousand years from now suck yeah. my dick. <laughs> <laughs> because a thousand years from now, you know who the people in the future are going to be the fuck a bunch of robots. And the prophet said, "No, people, it's going to be technology, bro. We're going to be fucking like in the Matrix. We're just suck batteries." My dick. Yeah, yep, yep. All right, Can you believe, on. Ryan? Do you believe that you could be a part of a document that one day will be re- a religion for an entire future um, society? Well, after what Justin just said, uh, possibly. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah.